Episode number three, Revenge of the Fidget Spinner. Let's get on into our next assignment. Here comes Supervisor Bot. Better look busy. Ah, look busy. Okay, everybody, let's make some business. Johnson, I'm counting on you to paradigm shift. He's going to see me keep the fidget spinner going, but also look busy. That's what I like to hear. Ah, it's broken. Whoa. Good job. I've been thinking about giving you a promotion. In fact, <laughs> if nothing goes wrong in the next 10 seconds, the job's yours. 10 seconds? Wah, fidget spinner! Oh, I can't control it! It's out of control! Wah! See, that's what I like about oh. you. You're a rebel. Always think <laughs> out of the box. Take this. The promotion's yours. Ooh, perfect. Hells yes. Human assistant to the supervisor. But I've lost my fidget spinner. And I'm kind of heartbroken. Good job, human. You're climbing the ranks. No. And here comes Bossbot. <laughs> Looks like he's got more work for you. Bossbot. Bossbot. I need you to pick that up for me. Please. Please? Oh. Well, I've got this. I guess I should put that up here so everybody knows what's up. But I've lost my fidget spinner. Well, it's gone. And it's probably for the best. So let's get back to work. What's our next assignment? Hello, human. What's up? I am Boss Bot. I know High five. you've logged in, so I'm here to give you your first task of the day. We need to bring some new bots on board, so look through your resumes and find two bots to hire. Hire for what? Sir? Oh, you went to the break room. Not working very hard, are you? You heard them. Make sure you pick the best <laughs> bots for the job. Okay. Well, uh. I like levers because it's pretty obvious what you do with them. You just pull them. Seems we're stamping stuff here. So uh, let's just make sure it works. <laughs> it's a do job post it. Okay. It does not work. Sir. <phone rings> Sir, it's broken. Okay. Resumes. 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 Print some resumes out. Oh, here we go. Resume. Booyah! Uh... Nailed it! <laughs> this is pretty sick. Let's see. Valuable job skills. Perfect. Okay. Is this my resume? Yes, it is. <laughs> Please hire me. I can job and have valuable job skills. Um... I don't know. He seems like a qualified applicant. It's very excellent language skills. <laughs> I've just hired myself. <laughs> Perfect. So what now? That may be the only resume that I have. So um, <laughs> I don't really need to resign yet. I haven't done much here. And uh, try and find those other resumes. Where'd they have gone to? Oh. Maybe it's in that file cabinet that says resumes on it. Let's see who we got. Bandit bot. Being sketchy, cooking books, acquiring cheese. Hell yeah, I'm all about that cheddar. Hipster bot. Ugh, oh, say no more. And we've got a safari bot. He looks pretty sweet. That mustache alone is uh, qualification enough. What? How did you get back in there, hipster bot? And a tourist bot who... Is an alien or just crazy sunglasses? Okay, this guy will not leave me alone. You're going into the trash. <laughs> oh, he's avoiding the trash too. <laughs> so, eh, just uh, I'm gonna have Safari Bot and Bandit Bot. How many more? Oh, I need two more, so that works out. There's one. And there's. Can't believe oh. it's my first day. Hey, bud. Yeah, have fun. Go. I don't know, do whatever you do on Safari. Take some sweet pictures. And then Bandit Bot, so he's coming. I need to defend myself. Magic One Ball, is Bandit Bot going to kill me? You're fired. That sounds like a yes. But you're gonna have to defend me. Uh, ah, Bandito! Oh, he's actually... Kind of nice. 
<laughs> so go do whatever it is you gotta do while I figure it out what I have to do. New memo! Have you seen the latest sales report? No. This isn't good. Load up the old spreadsheet program and fix these numbers. Sounds like a plan. Profit Manager 99. Let's do it. So this computer is on. Let's close that up. Man, I miss that fidget spinner. <laughs> and, uh, whoa, what are we doing here? Sales, $500. Expenses, $7 million on hot sauce and $322 million on staples. That sounds about right. I, there was some uh, pretty significant staple carnage earlier that I will take responsibility for. So, what am I supposed to be doing here? Just, oh, cooking the books. <laughs> Heck yeah. That's what I'm all about. And you know who's also good at cooking the books? That bandit robot. Where did he go? I need his help. So how should we do this? Well, obviously we're not going to you know, massage those numbers on expenses. That seems pretty logical for staple expenses. Uh, let's just inflate these sales to... <laughs> Not very exciting. 1,010,101,010. But we're in the green pretty significantly. Ta-da! Oh, <laughs> the books are on fire. Well, I want to put this next to my other books, but I hope the fire doesn't spread. Just try and thread that in there next to the Newton's Cradle. That's pretty awesome, actually. That is a pretty sick piece of interior decorating. Oh, does he need that? Oh. <laughs> well, it was fun while it lasted. Maybe I can make myself another copy. Wow. You cook those books like a professional gourmet chef. <laughs> See ya. You're welcome. Yeah. All right. One more? One more. Cha ching What is this? Snack time. It's time for lunch. At midday, humans would interact with primitive robots known as vending machines <laughs> to obtain food. Oh. Thank you. We've got a Robobuck. In job we trust. One money. So it looks like all of these cost one money, although I have no reason to believe that. What do I want to eat? You know, those Doritos were pretty good. Doritos. I'm sorry, not Doritos. Triangles. Ranch flavored. But I'm going to have to go for that spicy Dorito. Or <laughs> burrito. Goodness me. And that is A. Ching. Oh Looks yeah. Delicious. Enjoy your meal, human. <laughs> Nothing quite like a vending machine burrito which hasn't been wrapped in anything. So you know what? I need to double down. This seems really illegal. <laughs> you know, if you could print a car, would you? Or steal a car, download a car. What was that crazy ad? I don't know. But if you could download a burrito, yes you would. <laughs> Ah, what kind of burrito is this? Looks like uh, veggie, um, pinto bean. That eh, doesn't matter. It's all the same. <laughs> Double burritos. Can you get me a candy bar? Can I? Oh, you know what I was just gonna say is I should have copied that money. Speaking of illegal things, now that I have another opportunity, I'm going to do that. Oh, oh, whoa! Fake money. Fake money? What am I going to do with fake money? <laughs> you have to earn my money. Well, I didn't earn this one. I just took it from you. So let's see if this takes the fake money. Nope. I was kind of hoping that it was going to uh, do something kind of fun. But uh, I guess it just doesn't work. So let's use the real money. What did he want? Candy bar. Nuts and bolts. That's a B. Looks like it's wow. stuck. Sadly, this was common with early generations of robots. Mm, try and shatter that glass. Magic one ball, you failed me once. Whoa! Failed me twice. Okay, well, you're useless. You're dead to me. <laughs> so let's... Hmm. Am I missing something? Oh, there we go. 
Nailed it. All right, candy bar. You know what? You've been nice to me, generic bot 3000, so I'm going to give you two candy bars. And uh, while I'm at it, I'm going to print one for myself as well, just so that we can uh, eat these together in solidarity. So here you go. Take that. Thanks, coworker. Nice. Pretty good. Chocolatey. Metal and chocolate, yeah. <laughs> so, woo! Now that I have eaten my lunch and uh, absorbed all of the goodness, which is probably safe for humans, that's somewhat disconcerting, I am going to go into my food coma. So thank you guys for watching part three. More to come. Hope you guys are enjoying Job Simulator. And stay tuned where we will upgrade with whatever task that might be.